Hi campers, Gary here from selfinflatingmats.co.uk or Cross Camping where you can come and see us down near Cambridge, SG86EY. Uh, video here for the camper Kip Wide Boy self inflated mat or SIM as some of us uh, call them. So it's called the Wide Boy because it's uh, yeah that little bit wider. Most self inflated mats are about 60 centimeters wide. Uh, single ones. This is uh, about 70 something. Let's have a quick look just show you so you've got the measurements there Okay, and the pack size will be in the description on the website so Wide boy super comfy um, 10 centimeters thick Nice blue color on the top But if that's too much for you, there's nothing to stop you turning it over and just having the uh, grey colour. It's quite nice that they uh, they do that, I think. Um, yeah, 10 centimetres thick, so good and thick. Now, the great thing about having a thicker self-inflating mat is the fact that if you prefer to have the mat really firm as this is, then that's great. But I personally, um, being a slightly heavier chap, displace more air, so I like to lie on it. And then what I do is... I just open the valve a little bit, a little bit of air seeps out and then I shut it so I can get it to exactly the comfort level I want and that's the beauty with the thicker ones in particular. Uh, really really tough fabric, um, sometimes a little bit trickier to blow, sorry not blow, to deflate these sorts of mats. The idea is you would open the valves up at the end and then what we would do is fold the mat, kneel on it, fold the mat, kneel on it. Keep doing that until you've got you know, a good amount of air out. And then shut the valves. There's one on either corner on this one. And then unroll the mat again. And then this time, roll it with the valve shut. And as you move up the mat, you'll end up with a sort of bunched up bit of air at the end. You then open the valves and finish off do the valves up so it can't suck any more in because that's that's how self-inflating mats work initially the roll mat is you know quite thin and small relatively you'd want to check the say the sizes on this this big boy or wide boy um so you would unroll it and the mat would be really thin you open the valves and the foam naturally wants to suck the air in then you do the valve up so yeah that's gary from uh, selfinflatingmats.co.uk talking about the camper Kip Wide Boy. Cheers.